Got a nice little incline here. This bike does not care about inclines. Woo! Hey, what's up, y'all? We're here at Powerful Lithium with V, and we're getting Hi, ready to we're getting ready to jump on his heavily modified Super Seventy Three. We're also here with Jen from She Wolves. Richie's here. Tails here as well. Say what's up, y'all? Yeah, we finally made it out here. We finally made it out here. So yeah, we're gonna take a ride on this monster here. This is what people test ride when they come in. Yeah, five kilowatt motor, same two volt system, uh, 100 amps controller, color display. In this bike right now is 42 amp hours, but usually we have full frame battery, 51 amp hour. Okay. Uh, Molly cell, high grade A cells, high discharge rate. Voltage sag on minimum, like one or two volts only, no matter what kind of power you're pulling. Motorcycle tires, uh, Domino throttle, Magura MT5E uh, brakes, uh, disc uh, rotors, uh, they are 220s, Tapia seats, custom. So if somebody gets a Super 73 stock and they want anything, anything that you have on yours done to it, more, you guys can do it all. Even more. Yeah, so if you guys just got an e-bike and all you know is that you want to go faster and you don't know much about e-bikes, but you do know that more volts gets you more range and more power, just hit them up. Just tell them you want to go faster, what kind of bike you have, they'll give you tons of options. You ready for test? Yep, let's go for a ride. What kind of top speed should we expect? I'm not going to try it, probably, but just curious, like, what's the fastest you've gone on this? Right now, tune on it is like 55, 60 miles an hour. Okay. What's the fastest you've gone? 69. Whew. Like long road, yeah. actually on highway. Okay. 69, with my weight. Uh, easy, you will reach easy 55 miles an hour anytime. Okay. Even 60, and after that, you need time to reach okay. high speed. But you will see, compared to stock uh, bike, this bike, like you, you're reaching 30 miles an hour in 40 seconds, if you want. Okay. Course. And what should I expect? How should how should I expect the regen to feel? Regen is not too high. Okay. It's just to help you to slow down. Okay. But brakes they really good. Even like if you hit the front brake hard, you can flip over. Okay. They are very strong. All right. So we've got it on here. We're at seventy five point eight volts. I mean, I've got brake, it in level one. I'm gonna start off in level one and then maybe ramp it up. Well, and we'll see how it feels. Level one is around uh, nine miles an hour. Oh, okay. So start with level two. Okay. Easy. Hit the brake, that means when you hit the brake, Ooh. throttle is dead. Okay. Yeah, so it's definitely taller than my bike, but I'm 5'4", y'all. As you can see, I can't and get both feet on the ground, tough. and it's not too bad. So we're going to go for a ride. Thank you, V. We'll see ride you when safe. you get back. See you. Enjoy. Oh, it's so smooth. I've reached the top speed of level two really quickly. So cruising at level two, it looks like the top speed on level two is about 20 miles per hour. So we're gonna push it up to level three. And then let's see how that feels at this light here. The brakes feel so, so good on this thing. Holy crap. Oh my, what a difference from just one to two. Actually, no, I'm in three. What a difference from two to three. Holy cow. Yeah, I can get used to this. All right, let's do a Yui here. I'm gonna put it in four. And let's see how that feels. All right, so we're in four now. Oh my, holy cow. This thing is a rocket. <laughs> so like I said earlier, when I was standing with V, if you don't know much about e-bikes, but you know that you want your e-bike to be able to do this, then uh, just hit up the folks at Powerful Lithium, man. Like stop wasting your time. Don't do any research. Just hit them up. They got everything you need and then some. Everything that he's done to his bike here, they can do at that shop that we just left. And holy cow, I don't think I wanna go past level four. I don't even know how high it goes, maybe six. 
Let's see what the hill is like. Got a nice little incline here. This bike does not care about inclines. Woo! Bro. Damn. I said we hard wood. Damn, I had the green, but all right. Good thing I was looking. He was not. He was on his phone while on a scooter. So yeah, just for uh, safety, I'm gonna drop it back down to three because this is a pretty congested neighborhood here. But I'm so impressed, man. I, I would love to have something that uh, responds like this. Yeah, so we're gonna jump on Richie's Suron next and see what that feels like. <laughs> it's so smooth, dude. What's the impressions? I couldn't go past four because I was scared. But four... <laughs> I told you, he... <laughs> you were scared? Yeah, four, four is amazing. Like for here, four is a little too much. Three is perfect, but it goes up to six? Up to five. <laughs> oh, shit, okay. Five yeah, no, nah, this 60 miles an hour. I'll check this out. I'll check this out. It, it accelerates smooth but quickly. Yes. It's it's a really good balance. Our acceleration is there. That, like I said, if you want to be on 30 miles an hour, you can be in two, three seconds if you want. Yeah. Compared to stock, you need 30 seconds to reach 30 seconds. Yeah, the balance of the seconds. acceleration is yeah, perfect, that's the man. Point. So uh, I like smooth. This if you need power, you lift up on five and you pin. You yeah, this is this is up. amazing. Balance. Yeah, I never rode something that responded like that. So I'm gonna jump on this one next and see how that feels. But this is this is a winner right here. Fuck yeah, bro.